take your 7 8 of an inch ribbon and cut 14 pieces. Each piece is two and a half inches. And once you've made this flower, you can play around with it and you can make the pieces shorter or longer. And if you want to make a bigger flower, you can even do one and a half inch ribbon and make the pieces bigger. And then what you do after you cut them is make sure to seal your ends. Taking your piece, we're going to iron it flat. So fold it in half and then use your alligator clip to hold it like this. And then just take your iron and iron that, that down. And you just want it to have a crisp fold. So you can see like that. So go ahead and do this to the rest of your 14 pieces. So now we're going to glue our pieces together. So taking your pieces, you kind of, if you have a ribbon like this, you're going to, I'm going to stagger them. So I'm going to have the dots and the, and the chevron like on different things so it's not like that. So if you have a printed pattern, just watch out for that. And if they're all the same, then that will make it a little bit easier. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to glue them on. And it's important where we glue it. So as you see here, I have this corner coming up to about the middle of this ribbon. And so now we're just going to glue it. I'm just going to put a dab of glue on the middle of the ribbon on the, towards the bottom. And then glue on my piece. So then I'm going to take the next one and we're going to do the same thing. So we get to a point where we, we want to be able to fold this ribbon under this ribbon. And so as you can see that's going to be kind of hard to do. So what we're going to do is we're just going to cut some of our excess ribbon off. Whenever we do a cup, we gotta make sure it is still the ends. Then we'll just continue gluing. And then you can see here that we kind of have like a slinky type of ribbon. So it makes it easy to bring the back around and glue it on. So placing glue on that side, we're going to glue it underneath the first one. And that finishes making the ribbon part. So we're just going to, to finish it up. So take your clip and also a felt circle and then just place your clip like this on the felt circle. And then take your hot glue gun and put hot glue all around the felt circle. Take your flower and place it on top. And then just to finish it off, take your gem. And you can also do buttons or corker. Ribbon would be really cute right here too. 
or resin, just whatever you would like to do for a center. And then just glue it on the inside. And that finishes our flower.